students in this class we are going to see about direct online starter by drawing as well as understanding the concept normally the direct online starter is used for three phase squirrel cage induction motor low power rating up to 4 kilowatt why because means the starting time the back emf is zero therefore starting current is 25 times of rating currents therefore the heat loss will be more i square r at the same time the power losses also increases therefore the supply voltage will be goes to reduce due to that other equipments goes to damage particularly here the low power rating therefore power loss is less therefore we can give the direct supply to the motor so it is called as direct online starter listen i am going to draw the diagram first so in any exam point of view starters 50 percentage of mark for diagram only if you know the diagram remaining all those things are easy therefore take a paper and first of all try to draw the direct online diagram first you have to draw the three horizontal line at the end you have to make a two circle and make a symbol of squirrel cage induction motor then erase the left side parallelly likewise right side as shown in board then you have to make a four rectangular bars in a left side over the horizontal line as shown in blackboard then you have to draw a vertical two lines in between that rectangular box then we have to start a line from any one face any one face and it is goes to the bottom of the rectangular box in the left side you have to make a winding then it will return back and it comes on the left side of the rectangular box make it as full stop then right side you have to start the diagram and make a rectangular box and you have to finish in next one face next one face any one face then you have to make a s1 s2 s3 s4 switch at the particular condition s1 switch must be in outer of two line then that switch is called the start switch next switch is s2 switch it is inside the two lines and it must be in touch it must be in touch next switch s3 switch or remote switch this is also similarly you have to place inside the two lines but in touched condition then finally s4 switch this is called as overload release switch here this is this comes below the right side erased region right side erased region in the erased part you have to make a winding that winding is called as overload release coil overload release coil each face separately you make a winding and try a two vertical line and connect the switch that switch must be in outward the point outward the points now we have to make a setup starting time what the current flow will be there starting time the current flow like this if you are started from starting phase if it is r phase means r phase if it is b phase means b here i am using b phase y phase therefore starting y s1 s2 s3 s4 b this is the starting time you have to write it a box running time y phase a conductor s2 s3 s4 then third condition faulty condition under voltage under voltage times under voltage coil is energized then the switch will goes to open a switch will be goes to open therefore the entire m1 m2 m3 will goes to open motor will not goes to supply then last condition last mode 
overload if any overload we are applying means in load test we know if you are applying load to the motor current is increases current increases means magnetic flux is also increases therefore s4 will be opened now i am going to explain what is meant by starter what is the function of starter one by one i basically i will explain the starter with ampere for example in matches why we are using ampere ampere are used to for start the match stop the match safety to the player likewise here the starter is used for start the motor stop the motor safety to the motor first of all in direct online starter how the starting is taking place s1 s1 is the starting button or pushing button when you are push the button it is like a green color if you are put in pushing the button it will go and touch the conduct now the current flow will be like this b phase s1 s2 s3 s4 and it will finish in b phase now under voltage release coil will goes to magnetized when near by magnet we having a iron rod what will takes place iron rod will goes to attract iron rod will goes to attract m1 m2 m3 a will be in touch now the current will goes to the motor motor will be rotate and running condition now the s1 switch will be goes to original condition open open condition but now the current flow is like this running time what b phase a conductor s2 s3 s4 and it will also close now also under voltage release coil is magnetized no problem motor will runs continuously even though we are removing the switch from green button now if you want to stop what you have to do press the stop button it will goes inside now the current will not flow in the under voltage release coil it is goes to demagnetized now you have to place your diagram invertedly top position goes to bottom bottom position goes to top now due to the gravitational force m1 m2 m3 a conductor goes to down it will goes to what open conductor will goes to open conductor goes to open means motor will be off this condition will be takes place whenever the supply is gone or voltage is less than 300 or 200 voltage magnetic power of the under voltage coil will be goes to less why we all know m is equal to ni mm of is equal to n into i now voltage is decreases means current is also decreases magnetic flux is goes to less therefore m1 m2 m3 and a conductor goes to down goes to down due to gravitational force finally we are going to study about overload condition motor is running we are applying more load to the motor it drawn more current once the current is increases what will takes place magnetic power is increases due to the magnetic power increases nearer by we having a iron rod it will moves upward s4 switch will goes to open now under voltage release coil the power supply is cut or electron flowing is cut under voltage coil is goes to demagnetize m1 m2 m3 a conductor goes to the original pot positions that means open motor is safe so if you are like this video please share the link to your friends